The National Association of Nigeria Students has issued a one-week ultimatum to the federal government to resolve its disagreement with the Academic Staff Union of University or face a national mass action by students across the country. Now, NANS President Sunday Adedayo said this in Sokoto shortly after signing the reviewed constitution of the association at the state government house. Mr. Adedayo said the Students' Union has given the federal government till the 28th of February to meet and resolve issues with ASU. Speaking earlier, Sokoto State Governor Aminu Tambuwa appealed to the Academic Staff Union of University to find a way of resolving their disagreement without embarking on strikes. Governor Tambuwa also called on the federal government to find a way of meeting the demands of ASU despite the dire economic challenges the country is facing. We are calling on the federal government of this country that as a matter of urgent, because the Congress, who is the highest organ of NANS that was called in Shokoto, has given a mandate in that Congress. There is a motion upon motion, and the Nigerian students have concluded, and they have given a mandate that if federal government and ASU do not resolve these differences between today and Friday, that Nigerian students should mobilize and give the language that the government understands, which is the last C, that a day of action has been, a day of mass action has been, has been, has been fixed. We are seeing that um, strikes do not actually uh, have the cause of us to the strike. Uh, and we are seeing that there should be a better uh, model of engagement with the federal government on all of this. Uh, and if, if it's questions or whatever, then it would be well. I had the development also to be uh, more responsive in addressing those issues that have mutually identified. Uh, I know that uh, the economy is not, uh, this is all that level of stress, but we must find some accommodation for some of those uh, uh, conditions and terms that the government uh, have uh, signed with us.